of a German tank in 1944. They didn't come bigger or better than this machine here. It was left in a field behind this schoolhouse here in Laglise, because Laglise was the place where Piper made his last stand. This is where the net tightened around him. By Christmas Eve 1944, the game was more or less up for Camp Group Piper. Piper abandons Laglise. He leaves all his armor behind. He leaves all the half tracks, all the artillery, all the tanks, everything. And he goes out of this place on foot. He walks out of Laglise. On Christmas Day, Piper and the 800 remaining men of his armored battle group straggle back to German lines. In nine days of fighting, they have lost 70 tanks. More than 2,000 men are killed, wounded, or captured. Across the Ardennes, the fighting continues. And on January 12, 1945, the Germans are overwhelmed by Allied reinforcements and air power. And the Battle of the Bulge comes to an end. Hitler's final gamble has failed. We did the best we could. The soldiers themselves tried to fight as hard as they could. If you're lacking a lot of things, you can fight as much as you want. But if there's no material, you can't go forward. You just have to draw back. That's how simple it is. Only our faith was stronger than what we had. That's how it was. The casualties on both sides are enormous. More than 90,000 German soldiers are killed, wounded, or captured. Almost 20,000 Americans die, and 50,000 are wounded. We lost a lot of people. We would lose 40, 50 men at a crack. How many times I got out of tanks alive, yet my buddy that couldn't get out would be half in and out of the tank, hollering, Les, Les, I'm on fire, get me out. And you'd see the fire gush up over him, and he'd die right there. At the time, I didn't think anything of it. All I was worried about was getting out of there. You know, I was very proud the next day, but you also realize that, of course, you know, that's another thing that happens to you kind of late. You realize what it costs is some of your very best friends. But uh, I wouldn't want to do it again, that's for sure. <laughs>